Going fast may be the name of the game in MotoGP, with horsepower, acceleration and top speeds usually grabbing most of the headlines, but you won't get far without taming the beast. There's no point in going quickly if you can't slow it down. So we find out just what it takes when it comes to braking power in the top class of the World Championship. With a bit of help from carbon brake technology, just how do you get a bike to stop efficiently from 340 km an hour? we enlisted the assistance of Eugenio Gandolfi, chief engineer for Brembo. You have to define brakes for in two fundamental components. One, one is safety and the other one is uh, performance. I mean, safety 50% and performance 50%. Carbon is much more lighter, so it's much more easy on, has an unspring weight in the changing direction and, uh, and so on. Plus, the carbon are, have a little bit more high efficiencies and uh, they have the capacity to dissipate the, the, the temperature much better way. The kinetic energy during the brake becomes temperature, so we have, you must have something which is uh, more able to, to dissipate this kind of temperature. You must stay between the 300 degrees to the 700 degrees, which is the, the, the optimis, the optimized temperature for, for, for the braking and you must keep this value under control for the low temperature as well, for the high temperature as well. So for some circuit which is considered not, not so high braking cost, you can use low mass. Low mass also less weight, so in terms of handling is also better compared to the, the high mass. But in certain circuit where you have, uh, which is con we, we consider very heavy uh, braking cost, you must have high mass because you must have some component to achieve the temperature. It's not possible to use carbon discs uh, in the wet because uh, how is the characteristic of the, the, the friction level. Carbon needs uh, temperature to work, a sort of temperature range to work in the best, uh, the best way, which is difficult to get on, on, on wet condition. Plus, it's more aggressive compared to the steel discs and the steel disc is going to give you more feeling. Carbon is uh, quite expensive compared to conventional discs, but also uh, the wearing rate and the, the, the cost uh, is quite good uh, matching because uh, the discs can stay over 3,000 kilometers and the pad as well can stay as well on 3,000 kilometers, which is, means four, three, four races are easy, which is not possible to get with a steel disc. Certain point is uh, for us is give to the rider the, the same feeling, exactly the same feeling from the first lap to, to, to the last lap, where you have a bike where it's heavy at the beginning with a very high grip for, for the tire and uh, less grip for the tire in the end, there were less weight. So it's more easy to work with the front compared to the rear because rear is very personal. There's some rider you, where you have the rear brake only for rules. They never use the rears. Some other one they use the rear has uh, for brake, but as well for cornering speed control. And uh, it's very personal. Uh, as I said before, we have a lot of more combination for the rear in order to optimize the rear for each rider compared uh, to the front. We have much more choice for the rear. During the braking time, all the weight is going to the front. So during the weight transfer, Due to the dynamics of the bikes, uh, uh, you have the maximum braking force on the front, not in the rear. For us, it's very, let's say, easy to give more performance compared to, to, to now. Considering then uh, our brake system can generate more than 550, almost 600 horsepower, which is almost double of the horsepower generated by the engine. So the problem is how to use this horsepower. Because the bike has some limitation. The bike has some uh, dynamics limitation under the brake. Compared to the cars where you can use a much more uh, braking performance because you have four axles so, and a, a, a lot of downforce. Plus, during the braking time, you have the, your center of gravity coming up. So a lot of difference, much more compared to the car to work, uh, to work on it. So a lot of consideration must be done.